What is OSVR? OSVR is the freedom to shape the future. It's open access for everyone to the next stage of technology, to a reality you can help create. OSVR is open source virtual reality. It's the open standard for the development of both software and hardware for virtual reality. What does that mean? Well, pretty much three things. First, it's open source, which means that all the hardware and software designs are completely open for anyone and everyone to develop on. Second, it's supported by some of the leading companies in the industry today. Companies who are committed to promoting virtual reality and keeping it free and open for all. Finally, it's all about gaming. While the work done for OSVR can be used for pretty much everything, the main purpose of OSVR is creating the best and most immersive virtual gaming experience. However, there are many things that OSVR is not. For starters, OSVR is not controlled by a single or group of companies. The OSVR software license uses the Apache 2.0 license, the same license that Android is licensed on. To put it simply, the open platform Android is to smartphones, as OSVR is to virtual reality. Further, OSVR is also not a standalone OS. At this time, OSVR runs on Linux, Android, and Windows. Finally, OSVR is not a competitor to existing HMDs like Oculus. In fact, OSVR was designed to work with all HMDs, and we hope that the work on OSVR will lead to even better VR devices in the future. Why OSVR? While we believe that virtual reality is an exciting platform for the future, it's still quite a ways away from a consumer product that everyone can use. And lots of work still remains to be done, and not by just one or a few companies. With the concerted efforts of the community and the developers, we'll be able to achieve an incredible VR experience sooner rather than later. With that in mind, there are a few problems that OSVR is addressing. Hardware and software fragmentation, industry adoption, and the lack of access to VR development platforms. Today, there are hundreds of different VR devices, each sending and receiving data in a different way, such that supporting them would mean development effort required for every single device. With OSVR, each device and software is now able to connect on a single open standard and immediately become compatible with each other, dramatically reducing development efforts both for the hardware and software developers. OSVR was built for everyone to have access to. As such, some of the world's leaders in VR have come together to adopt OSVR. From VR glasses, motion sensing controllers, cameras, eye tracking, and leading game engines, adoption of OSVR is growing at an incredible rate due to its open nature. To provide an open development platform for hardware, OSVR is providing the OSVR Hacker Development Kit, a completely open source kit that will allow hardware hackers to plug in and connect their devices without having to build their own HMD or allow software developers to get up and running on developing for VR immediately. All the designs and schematics for the OSVR Hacker Developer Kit are completely open source and available for download at the OSVR site. Any user who has access to a 3D printer and the materials can now build his or her own Hacker Development Kit at home. In the event developers don't have access to the resources to build the Hacker Developer Kit, Razer will be taking pre-orders for the kit at just $199.99 US and expects to ship the kit starting June 2015. Join the cause for an open standard and find out more about OSVR and the Hacker Dev Kit at osvr.com.